I'm Heather Wenzel. I'm a clinical research nurse for the Center for Translational Research located here in Grand Island at St. Francis Medical Center. Currently, the biorepository project, we just have one protocol here at St. Francis, and we're collecting blood and tissue for oncology patients. So patients diagnosed with a malignant tumor, cancer, within the last 12 months. Those specimens are being collected, stored here at St. Francis, and then eventually will be shipped to Maryland right now, um, the Center for Translational Research hub. I go through OR schedules, clinic schedules over at the Cancer Center, and try to review different charts to see if a patient would be eligible. If the patient appears eligible, I'll then contact the physician. It's up to the physician to really determine if the patient is an appropriate candidate for the trial. With surgical patients, we'll again approach the patient, gather the informed consent, and then we really work closely with the OR staff and the pre-op staff to coordinate the tissue collection. So notifying me when the patient goes back for surgery, notifying me of when the actual cut time will be, and then I'll actually come into the OR, gather the specimen from the circulating nurse, and take it to pathology. From that point, pathology has pretty close instructions per the protocol on how to dissect the tumor and get it into small enough pieces that we can then collect it, put it in cryo vials, and snap freeze it in liquid nitrogen. Really, the Center for Translational Research is on the cutting edge of what cancer research is moving towards, and that's looking at tumor tissue from a genetic level, figuring out why two people with the same diagnosis can come in, have the same treatment, and have a different outcome. What we're really doing is looking how genes affect the growth and development of cancer tumors. From there, we can help manage and basically gain a more personalized approach to cancer treatment, management, and care. Our patients are amazing. They're selfless, they're in one of the hardest times of their entire life, and every time I approach a patient, I almost always get the same response of, well, if I could help somebody in the future, why wouldn't I do it? I think what I'm the most excited about is that CTR is really taking something so complex molecularly and they're moving it to real clinical solutions. So they're taking something like DNA and cancer and they're going to work with it, research it, and turn it around to improve patient care and really take it down to the bedside, which is where it's the most important.